See how to create a JSON object, how to insert into a JSON object, how to insert into a nested JSON object, and how to format a JSON. So this is the first thing we have to import a JSON. Now I I want to in create a JSON object as string, my str. <coughs> so I just declare as a dictionary. Next thing I want to add one JSON variable that is name equal to Mike. So I have a key as name and a value as Mike. Now I want to include the age into this Mike. So we have my string of name Mike and my string of age as 40. Now if I go if I'm going to print this string this my str now you can see that it thinks a dictionary. Now if I want to print the value You can see it's a JSON object. It's a dictionary. Okay, so it's an object. Let's forget about this. Okay, now, now I have a string. For example, this let me let it be the string. It has name as Mike and age as 40. Now I want to, this is a normal string. <coughs> if I give the property print type of my str, then it will show as a string class is string. Now I want to convert this into a JSON. So in other tutorial we have seen what is the use of load command. So JSON str is called JSON dot loads of my string. So right now if you want to print the property of this JSON str we can see it will be a dict. First is string and next is a dict. Now we have the JSON str available. So this is a so now this is a JSON. Now if we want to add a location and inside the location we should have a country and inside the country we have state in the district zip code etc. So how can we do that? <coughs> the first thing is I want to add a location. This is first for this is mainly used for some web programming if you want to create a log those kind of use case it is very useful for like a json object so first i am creating a dictionary location then i and inside the location i want state as well so first thing i am going to add a country in this json so location country equal to india now i have in the state, I am adding state as Delhi and the district as some M district so, and the location state is and the state and the location, this location inside the location we have one country. Now inside the location we have state. So inside the state we have these two items. Now we have all this thing. Now I am going to add this a JSON string. Here, this is a JSON, initial JSON string. So, if you want to have this, I will just comment it. And so, this is the JSON string. Now, I am going to add these things. So, it first creates a dictionary location, state location. Inside the location, I am adding country, India, state, district. Then, location, I am adding a state as another key and whole thing I am going to a location. Now I am just print this JSON string. You can see name, mic, age, to the location. Inside the location there is a country, India and inside the country we have state. Inside the state we have name Delhi and district MBH. So this is how we create a nested JSON. Now I'm going to now I just want to format this JSON to a readable form. So this for that it needs to convert to string and I'm just doing a JSON dot form JSON dot dumps into JSON str that is a JSON string and intent is for and now I am I want to print this JSON format. 
so you can see this print name my okay so this is the same thing so in the indentation i gave for so everything can location inside the location country state the name and date this way we can create a json and just this is mainly used for some web, uh, lo logging purpose and if you want to display something in a human readable form so we can just use the uh, indentation for with the json term so it will be a string and you can uh, re read it that's all